What's up guys, um, I'm going to be doing a video on the GoPro Hero 3 Plus Black. Um, so I had this GoPro for about a day and then it froze up. And I went on YouTube to see if I could fix it. And it looks like a lot of people have problems with the GoPro Hero 3 Plus Silver and the Hero 3 Plus Black. And it would freeze up where you couldn't press the mode button or the film button and it would just be frozen. You, you know, you could connect it to Wi-Fi, um, but other than that, it would just be frozen and you'd have to remove the battery on the back. So I'm going to show you how to fix this, um, but you will have to go to the GoPro website and possibly call a technician. So the first thing I did is I actually called GoPro and I went on to their website, and I'll pull that up right now. So this is a Dell computer. So I'll go to Chrome, um, pull this up. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'll sign in. So come back when we're done. Okay, guys, so now I'm at the Gmail page. Um, and I have two emails from the GoPro guys at their headquarters. But you can easily go to this at GoPro. So this is the page that pops up. And it's basically on their website. It's how to update your Hero 3 Plus camera. Um, and the way that I had to do it on this camera is because it wasn't functional. A lot of people say it's your SD card. Now I have a SanDisk SD card. It's the Extreme Plus. A lot of people recommend the Lexar 32 gig or whatever it is, 600X. It doesn't really matter. You know, this works fine. That's all I need. Um, so basically, I took my adapter and I put it into my computer beforehand. And then I went to this. So scroll down and at the bottom, it says update your camera manually. You're going to want to fill out your serial number right there, and then you'll hit the next step button. So I'll come back when I've done that. So I click next, and after I filled out that information, and you're going to pop up to this page, update your GoPro. So what you're going to do is you're going to click download update. You're going to download this update, and it'll pop up in downloads. So I'm just going to click next step because I've already done that. And you're going to want to insert your micro SD or your SD card. Go to next step. And you're going to want to do this. Because this is Windows computer, it already knows what to do versus an Apple computer. So it's going to pop up in downloads. So we'll go to that right now. So we're going down here to downloads. Gonna go up there to downloads. A lot of downloads on this computer. It'll pop up as update.zip. See, there it is right there. Now, what you're gonna wanna do is now pop in your SD card down in the little port. So I'll do that right now. Pop it out. One hand multitasking, so epicness. You're gonna wanna pop it into the side. Wherever this little bugger is. There we go. Pop in the little card. Push it in. It'll pop up. So now that we've got our SD card in there, what I would recommend doing is right click and this menu will pop up. What you're going to want to do is go to format and you're going to want to reformat this. You're going to start this and what it will do is it will delete all the content that's on this card to start with. Either if it's new or not, you're going to want to get all the information that you can off of it. So once you reformat it, you should click on it and there should be nothing on it. After you've done that, you're going to want to go to update.zip, click on it, 
And you should see these. There should be four pieces of information on them. You're going to want to click on that. Shift. Boom. And then you're going to want to paste that in there. So because I've already done that, we'll just go into my card. And this is what should be in there. It should pop up with those four files. Get started with GoPro, MISC, and DCIM. Now once you've done that, you've successfully transferred it onto your SD card. From there, what you're going to want to do, right click, eject. So I've just ejected it. Going to pop up the card and the card reader. Gonna take it, gonna put it in your GoPro. Make sure your GoPro is powered off. So in this tutorial, you're probably gonna have to take out your battery. So insert your battery. Insert your back door. And voila. Now you're gonna wanna turn on your camera and it should turn on. Now instead of coming to this screen, we'll go back to the computer and blow this up for you guys. After you've done what I just said and you've downloaded it on your card and you put it in your GoPro, you're going to turn it on or you're going to turn it off, put your SD card in and it should say updating. After it's updated, it should say update complete. After that, all your problems should be fixed. You can hit finish. So you successfully updated your GoPro and you should be able to scroll through all your settings. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys because this was such a struggle for me and I was very frustrated because I like this camera a lot and I hope that I'll be able to shoot some really cool videos. Um, but if you have any more questions, guys, just call or call GoPro or comment on this video. But I had no response for my buttons. You know, I could turn on the Wi-Fi and connect it to the GoPro app but that just wasn't helping at all. So, you know, you're going to want to do this update, and I honestly don't think it's the card. You know, if you have a laggy card, and you don't have a card that will go up to 95 megabytes and is very slow, then you're probably going to have problems, and you're going to want to get a good SD card. But other than that, it's internal to the GoPro. And you're going to want to do this tutorial and download this onto your SD card and then re-update your camera. So, yeah. Thank you, guys. See ya. After you click Next, you'll pop up to this page. Follow these instructions to have a good SD card. Make sure your battery is fully charged. And then click Next Step. Now you're going to want to fill out a name and a password. I'll fill this out and then I'll see you guys next. Hey guys, so some quick information about that tutorial I just did. I have a GoPro Hero 3 Plus Black Edition and the top and bottom button are completely freezing and it wouldn't work. So I was trying some things and nothing worked. I had done the newest update and the camera had just frozen. I couldn't use it for anything. So I called GoPro and they gave me the link and they walked me through some stuff. Um, as far as going on YouTube, everybody said it's your SD card. I find that to be false information, except for the fact that you may have the wrong SD card or micro SD card to begin with. So, for instance, I have the SanDisk Extreme Plus 32 gigs with 95 um, megabytes of speed. Um, I chose this card because it's what they had at Best Buy, and it's going to work for this camera. So, I guarantee you that in the tutorial, people will say, the Lex are 32 gig or 64 gig or whatever it is, um, 600x. 
you can get that SD card, but as far as it working for the fix, it only has to have enough capacity for what hero you're doing. So for instance, if I'm shooting 4K, I'm going to want to get a 120 gigabyte or 64 gigabyte card to hold that information, but you're just going to want a good card that will read all the videos and photos you take. Um, so that's the card and that's the problem. As far as the tutorial goes, um, you can just go to GoPro website, Google that. Um, all their information is on there. It's a great website. If you need to call tech support, they're very nice. Um, but you can just go to GoPro and uh, look up update for GoPro Hero 3 Plus, silver or black, and it should pop up. Um, either watch my video, which you probably already have because you're watching this, um, or you can just call GoPro and they'll email you this. Um, but you know, this will work on an Apple, um, Android, I'm assuming, and um, Windows computer because all you do is you download it and it'll pop up in your download folder. You're going to want to be able to right click. That was another issue. Um, so make sure that you have a mouse or you can right click on your computer. Um, but you should be able to do this at on any computer that you can right click on. Um, it'll pop up in downloads and then from there you can um, format that onto your SD card um, and then from there plug it in and it should boot itself up and update. So I hope this helps. This is very recent. It's May 16th, 2016 and this has helped me and it's been a struggle. So I hope this has helped you guys. Um, comment, like, subscribe. If you have any questions, feel free because I've done this and it was a pain in the butt. Um, but I'm not a tech support guy, so if you need to, just call GoPro. And um, thanks.